What is neuropathy and how does it relate to diabetes? Neuropathy is a condition characterized by damage or dysfunction of one or more nerves, which typically results in numbness, tingling, muscle weakness, and pain in the affected area. It can affect various parts of the body, including the feet, legs, arms, and hands. When it comes to diabetes, neuropathy is a common complication. Diabetes-related neuropathy, also known as diabetic neuropathy, occurs due to prolonged high blood sugar levels that damage the nerves. This condition can affect different types of nerves in the body, leading to various symptoms depending on the type of neuropathy. There are several types of diabetic neuropathy. The first is peripheral neuropathy. This is the most common type and often affects the feet and legs, causing symptoms like numbness, tingling, pain, and muscle weakness. The second type of neuropathy is called autonomic neuropathy. This type affects the autonomic nervous system that controls involuntary body functions like the heart rate, blood pressure, digestion, and bladder function. The third type is called proximal neuropathy, a rare type that affects the nerves in the hips, thighs, or buttocks, usually on one side of the body. How can diabetes affect the nerves? Diabetes can significantly affect the nerves, leading to a condition known as diabetic neuropathy. This occurs due to prolonged high blood sugar levels. Chronic high blood sugar levels can damage the blood vessels that supply the nerves with oxygen and nutrients, leading to nerve damage. There are several types of diabetic neuropathy, including peripheral neuropathy, autonomic neuropathy, proximal neuropathy, and focal neuropathy. Each type affects different parts of the body and has distinct symptoms. With peripheral neuropathy, this is the most common type and usually affects the feet and the legs. Symptoms include tingling, pain, numbness, and muscle weakness. It can also affect the hands. Autonomic neuropathy is the second type and this affects the autonomic nervous system that controls involuntary body functions like the heart rate, blood pressure, digestion, and bladder function. The third type is proximal neuropathy, a rare type that affects the nerves in the hips, thighs, or buttocks, usually on one side of the body. The fourth and the final type is called focal neuropathy. This type affects a single nerve, often in the head, torso, or leg, and can cause sudden weakness or pain. What are some common causes of neuropathy in adults? Neuropathy in adults can be caused by various factors. Here are some common causes. Diabetes. This is the most common cause of neuropathy, particularly diabetic peripheral neuropathy. Second, autonomic diseases, such as lupus and rheumatoid arthritis. Chemotherapy. Certain chemotherapy drugs can lead to neuropathy. Alcohol. Excessive alcohol consumption can lead to neuropathy. Kidney failure. Conditions leading to kidney failure, such as diabetes and high blood pressure, can also cause neuropathy. Inherited causes. Some neuropathies are inherited and run in families. Nutritional deficiencies. Lack of essential nutrients can lead to nerve damage, such as B12 deficiency. Traumatic injuries. Injuries that damage nerves can lead to neuropathy. Infections. Certain infections can cause nerve damage. And lastly, exposure to toxins. Toxic substances can cause nerve damage and lead to neuropathy. Can you have neuropathy without diabetes? Yes, you can have neuropathy without diabetes. Symptoms of non-diabetic neuropathy can vary widely based on the affected nerves and may include numbness, tingling sensations, burning pain, loss of coordination, and muscle weakness. While diabetic neuropathy is a common form, there are many other causes of neuropathy that are not related to diabetes, such as the ones already mentioned.